Hi everybody, I'm Sabine Lenzi, founder of Paper Specs with your weekly dose of paper inspiration. Every time you want to lament that your budget is just not big enough to create something really extraordinary, remember what Pauline Capote created with a home inkjet printer, some paper, and a sharp designer's eye. Challenged by her packaging class at the Academy of Art University in San Francisco to come up with a board game that appealed to designers, Pauline created one that is right after our own CMYK's heart. Hex, the clash of colors. From the very first glimpse of the box, you realize this isn't your average Milton Bradley amusement. Its distinctive hexagonal shape isn't just eye-catching, it's completely in keeping with the focus of the game, color. If you have not made the connection yet, it was designed as a nod to the hex color wheel, where every color has a value number. The telescoping lid of the set box features the hex logo at its center radiating out from that. The names of hundreds upon hundreds of colors are printed in minute lettering on the front with hundreds more along the sides of the lid. Along the edges are gradations of the color gamut, again a nod to the color wheel, and even more color greets you along the sides of the bottom part of the box. Inside you find the centerpiece of the game, the board, faithfully recreating the color wheel while managing to include subtle artist differences. The use of color gradation to simulate depth in particular is extremely effective, introducing a third dimension to a traditionally two-dimensional object. Beneath the game board are six metal game pieces, each a different color, colorful game cards, and a hexagonal tower that holds the cards while playing. The question, of course, is how do you play? Well, each game card contains a color-themed question. For example, in the Peanuts cartoon and comics, what color is Woodstock? Well, I won't keep you in suspense, and everybody knows Woodstock is yellow. Correct answers allow the players to advance, similar to Chinese checkers. Hex is a game that allows designers to compete with each other based on strategy and general design knowledge. It has a focus on minimalism and puts the attention on the colors of the spectrum. But seriously, the only truly minimal details concerning Hex are the resources that went into its making. It is, after all, a student project. The whole project was made almost entirely out of Red River paper. The base was constructed out of Canson artboard and everything was printed on Pauline's desktop inkjet printer. Then cut by hand, Yep, remember the good old X-Acto knife? And wrapped around the baseboard using double-sided tape. The game pieces were coated in spray paint. As you can imagine, all this means there's exactly one copy of Hex in existence. Thank you so much, Pauline, for entrusting us with your only copy long enough to share it with everybody and to play a few rounds of the game ourselves in between deadlines. Whenever you start a packaging project, you start with the age-old question, folding carton or setup box? If you're a Paper Specs Pro member, make sure to check out our guide to packaging. Find it at paperspecs.com under the pros only tab. Did you enjoy this video? Then please subscribe to our channel. And of course, it would be amazing if you share with all your friends. And keep sending me your fabulous printed pieces. I love to feature them. 